Hey everyone, uh, due to busy schedule and uh, some personal work, I couldn't make a proper edited video for this week question, answer, reveal and its explanation. But not to worry, I am going to reveal the answer over here and also I am going to explain you why this answer is correct. Now most of you have already given correct answer with a very good explanation. But for rest, I am going to explain this question. So the question was something like the information was that patient has history of scleroderma since 10 years and patient is referred to physiotherapy for the improvement of range of motion and better life. Now also the information is given that patient just received corticosteroid for myositis and for myositis we just did a video yesterday that you must have watched and also about this the information is given that patient is having range of motion restricted as well as soft tissues are hard also the information given here is that patient is having hyperesthesia which means patient is uh, very much prone to pain even with with a soft touch and we need to find out which can be the best protocol of the treatment in current stage option given to us are like option a is uh, patient is uh, patient can perform treadmill walking with 40% of body weight support. Option B is patient can perform therapeutic, therapeutic pool walking. Option C is that patient can perform closed chain aerobic endurance activities. And option D is that soft tissue mobilization uh, can be given to the patient. Now, my dear friends, out of all these options, if we just look into uh, to fit this patient scenario, only option B, which is walking in therapeutic pool, can be the easiest and the proper option for this patient because that option only is not going to increase pain for the patient and along with also is going to improve functional range of motion for the patient without causing any extra pain. So that is why this option B is the correct answer and I am glad that many of you have given the correct answer. Apart from this, why option A, C and D is not correct because option A again is like treadmill walking with body weight support. Okay, 40% body weight support is there, but that much hassle uh, patient will not be able to take because of the conditions like scleroderma and myositis. Option C again, close pack uh, endurance activities, aerobic activities is also not possible for the patient in this scenario. And option D, soft tissue manipulation, soft tissue mobilization will be very much painful for the patient because patient is already having hyperesthesia so i hope you understood this uh, answer and its explanation if you still have any doubts you can let me know in the comment section and thank you so much for being